Hey DIYers, what's going on? Mike Borders with the Mike Borders channel. Thank you for watching. In the event that your QuickTime player is not closing on your computer, we're going to show you how to close it. Let's take a look. All right, DIYers, here we are at the main screen and our Quick Player app shown right here has gone crazy, as you can see. What we are going to do is attempt to quit, and you'll notice once we click that, we patiently wait and nothing happens. We've tried this about, well, as you can see, many times. So now it's time to revert to a system forced quit. And to do that, you're going to simultaneously, or in other words, at the same time, push three buttons on your keyboard. Option, Command, and Escape. As you can see here, it comes up. In our case, QuickTime Player, we are going to force quit. And do you want to force QuickTime Player to quit? All right, DIYers, we are back with you on a different screen, as you can see here. And what happened was, as we were performing that force quit procedure, it completely shut down the entire QuickTime Player app, including the screen recording that I was currently using to record this video. So at that point, I went down to the applications and reselected the QuickTime Player app and reloaded everything so I could go back in and open up the screen recording to finish this video. And DIYers, as you see, it is extremely quick and easy to do this. Hopefully this helps. Do us a favor below the video. You'll see that thumbs up icon. Click on that, like the video. So subscribe to the channel. Definitely ring your YouTube bell. That would be very helpful to us. We'd really appreciate it. Thanks again for watching.